But check it out. <laughs> Making it rain four cries. <laughs> What's happening everybody? Welcome back to the channel. If you're keto, my name is John. I'm gonna kick this vlog off in just a minute. But first, if you haven't already hit that subscribe, click subscribe and hit the bell so you're notified when I do future videos if you are enjoying the content of this channel. I'll talk to you guys in just a minute. A few moments later. Okay, we're headed to the farmer's market to check out what's going on down there. But unfortunately, I gotta stop by the job because something went wrong with my machine and they're not sure how to get back up and going. So I told them I'd stop by and see if, what I could do. But we're gonna go enjoy this beautiful day. It's probably gonna get pretty hot today, but we're gonna have fun still. I think the kids are gonna go to their cousin's house and then me and Lindsay might get into something tonight. We're not sure yet, but we'll definitely bring you guys along. So if you haven't noticed yet, I'm in actually my mom's car because I had to borrow it because I had to take mine to the shop to get the AC fixed, but I had to throw some gas in there and now I'm headed to the job to see if I can get that fixed. Diagnosed the problem at work, got everything back up and going, saved the day. <laughs> and now we're getting ready to head to the farmer's market, check it out, see what's going on down there. It's going to be a hot one today, but it'll sh probably be fun still. So let's see what they got going on. All right, you guys, we decided to stop off at the gas station and get something to drink real quick because all the drinks over there are probably going to be ridiculously overpriced and they might not even have anything to uh, diet or anything like that. Did let the kids get a diet soda. It's definitely the lesser evil of the things that they were drinking in the past. So I'm going to go ahead and be okay with letting them have Coke Zero or Diet Coke here and there, especially when it's the weekend. <laughs> So I really do love coming out here to the farmer's market and the river market. However, parking is a nightmare. It takes forever to find a parking spot. But finally, what was it, like an hour we were in the car? <laughs> we did get a parking spot. So let's go check it out.
sugar. I'll take two of those. Yeah. Mm -hmm. No. Okay. And see, the cinnamon and the apple pie, uh, we oh. use a stevia. Okay, apple pie and cinnamon. One, two, three, four, five, six. I got six, babe. Is there an apple pie one? So they have this vendor down here at the River Market, and he's pretty awesome. He's got a bunch of keto-friendly uh, pork rinds. He does not use any sugar in them, so I'm pretty excited to probably be coming down here more often to grab some bags of these. I got six bags. <laughs> That's why we keep missing you. One of the coolest things about the farmer's market is how much money that you can save by going today. We got them both a bouquet of flowers. They're really beautiful for like 15 bucks. What do you think, guys? I like them. Did you have them make them like right there in the Yeah. That was so cool. Look how big that is. And this bouquet right here is very beautiful. So it was just $5. And it hasn't opened yet, so these will all be the size of these. That's crazy. Later. Black and Mm-hmm. All right, you guys, the farmer's market was pretty cool, but it's freaking hot out there, so we had to come back home. Get ready to go ahead to the barber shop to take my son to get a quick fade. <laughs> It'll probably be pretty cool. But check it out. <laughs> Making it rain for crimes. <laughs> you guys saw we went over there and got like a bag of each flavor that we thought would be good. They got all kinds of different flavors over there. I was really surprised that they didn't do any sugars in their rubs. They had the macros on there for us, and they even had some sweet ones. We got apple pie and cinnamon and he used stevia. So it was really cool to see a vendor that's doing that. He had this little sign, there was a farmer's market, mind you, so it wasn't like a big corporation. And had signs there that said like keto friendly. So that was so cool to see that keto's even making its way to these small time vendors into the worlds of like farmer's markets and things of like that. Cause you obviously want to go there to get your uh, produce or any kind of groceries. Uh, that'd be the best place to go. So I'm pretty excited to try all these out. We might have to do a little video on taste testing them all out, but yeah. all the pork rinds all right so Lindsay's gonna give some of these pork rinds a try unfortunately I'm still fasting so I'm just gonna give it a little taste test I don't know if this will be an honest shake though because Lindsay's not a big pork rind fan these so. are chili cheese grab one they're chili cheese bro what do we think are good they don't cover up the pork rind taste <laughs> I love pork rind taste. I hate pork rind taste. You are weird. I am weird. These ones are ranch. <clears throat> I've had these ones before. These are my favorite. These are better. Why don't you stuff your face a little more? <laughs> <laughs> these ones are white cheddar. Ooh. Okay. Right? Did you want to try white cheddar? Oh. Mmm. Yeah. Mmm. This one has like popcorn. They good? I like this one. Dang it, see, we should have tried them there and we could have got more of them. That's actually a really good deal, guys. I got six bags for $21. Not bad at all. Uh, $3.50 a bag. I'll pay that for some good pork rinds. These are taco. I want Ooh, a little taco. One. Taco. 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 There probably should be like cleansing pallets in between. <laughs> I don't really taste it. Apple is better than chili cheese. Okay, these are the apple pie ones. 
Okay. Mm. Apple pie. Pie. Dude, I get down with this. This is like a apple cinnamon twist. Yeah. You better not eat them all. We did get cinnamon as well. I we can't believe how much apple is in this. Like nice. how much apple taste is. I wonder what he uses. What's it? Norm's Gourmet Snacks. Guys, check them out. I'm not sure if they got Instagram or online, but I'm sure he probably will do some stuff online. So maybe they got them in your area. Cinnamon. Yep. Cinnamon. Oh, that's a straight churro. Is that a churro? I don't uh -huh. know churros. You kind of taste the pork rinder in those last two. There's so much sweet and stevia stuff. Yeah. That's good. Yeah. What do you guys think? Thumbs up? Yeah, I'm going to eat these. Thumbs up. Guys, pork rind taste testing is over. I'm getting ready to head to the barbershop to take my son to get a haircut. So hopefully he'll get a nice cut. Hello, hello. We are getting ready to head to the gym. Gonna get a bit of a workout in. It's leg and shoulder day, but it's not heavy day, so I'm gonna really try to get deep in the bucket. I really try to concentrate on getting deeper in my squats on light squat heavy day or on light days. But that's where we're headed right now to the gym. So we'll talk to you guys soon. So we got my son a nice fresh haircut. Check it out. Looks pretty good, I think. What do you think? So you like it? Mm -hmm. But now I gotta show him how to do some gel real quick. <laughs> Father problems. All right. Am I in ketosis? Am I not? I don't know. We're about to find out though. Point four. One off of being in nutritional ketosis. I'm not worried about it though. Went and worked out. Ran around. Kind of stressed out. Did a whole lot of things around the house. Um, took the kids to Lawrence. So. So a bunch of different things could play a factor here, but I'm not too worried about it. I was kind of interested in doing that five-day challenge of being in ketosis uh, with that Goody Beats got going on. A bunch of people right now in the keto community got going on, but I obviously would have failed today, so I might have to tighten it up. Guys, I had a bunch of movie snacks with my kids last night, and I did have a little bit of popcorn, so that could have something to do with it too. So just not sure yet, but I all right, you guys, that is going to conclude this vlog. Thank you all so much who are subscribed already. If you're not subscribed yet, hit that subscribe. You won't regret it. And if you're not following me on social media, Instagram and Facebook at i.f.yourketo. Thank you all so much. Life's too short, so have a fantastic day.